ELSS or tax saving mutual funds with ULIPS. So this is what you are going to see the major difference is alone in this video. Hi, hello, this is Ganeshan, your stock market profit coach and I help you in multiplying your wealth. So I am the author of the book One Page Stock Market Plan and Money Mix also. So before I proceed, please click the subscriber button so you, so you just get unlimited wealth in your life through my videos. And why ELSS and what is the major difference with ULIPS? The major difference is that the low lock-in period of three years while you compare it with ULU which is having a five years lock-in period and that is being sold as five-year policy and category average of 14% returns whereas for ULU policies it differs with time period it differs with companies and you need to know whether you're taking with Axis or uh, ICC or uh, HDFC or any other companies there are so many mutual uh, insurance policies and if you think that everything is giving a uh, different kind of returns and even in single policy you will have a different returns as such because the if if the debt component is huge you are going to get lesser returns if the equity component is high uh, during the recession time you will be getting a lesser returns and on top of it the expense ratio is just 2.5 percent in mutual funds and uh, as a equity cap it's going it's not going to be more than 2.5 percent whereas if you come to ULIP it starts with uh, 7-8 percent and at the, on the higher side it can be up to 10 percent and uh, just think of you are investing a lakh and out of it 7 to 9 thousand 10 thousand is going away as expenses and only remaining amount is being invested and you need to generate more than 14-15 percent for the first five years so that the expense ratios are overcome and fourth fifth year it comes down to 5-6 percentage and uh, from sixth year it may be around 4-5 percentage but um, this is how the charges are but people are so worried about paying 2.5 percent in mutual fund but i had seen so many people happily paying for ulip policies thinking that it's a life insurance let me let me have it and compounding works in long term and mutual funds people know that it's a long term policy but the risk they are thinking about risk whereas ulip it is being pushed as the most uh, uh, five year policy after five years you don't need to pay either if you want you can take it fifth year or after sixth year or after tenth year also that is how policies are pushed and people think it's five years maturity is coming you look i have seen so many clients asking me can i take my money after sixth year and then the returns are almost like superb uh, with that the, in the negative in the sarcastic tone i'm saying and finally it's a tax saving mutual fund with mis-selling as a five-year policy this is the most important point because what i had seen is that uh, on tax saving mutual fund perspective people think it's a risky thing i don't want to invest they think a lot whereas when it comes to uh, investing in ULIP policy they think it's a wise thing to do and rarely people make money in ULIP policy because it's a insurance come investment which doesn't work together and the product is good for pushing away uh, uh, you can uh, push make your money to stay in uh, some policy but uh, it's not good to stay invested for a long time because I think so many people staying for more than uh, 10 years they are getting not even getting the uh, invested money only when the when the uh, market is doing good just like what is happening right now you might be sitting on a huge profit or else uh, market may, may not uh, your your fund may not be doing good and on top of it the expense ratios which is which keeps take your money away uh, every six seven percentage just for from the th point of uh, expense ratio and also miss selling like it's not a five-year policy it's a full term 10 or 20 year policy then only it is possible to generate at least eight to ten percent returns and if you get it i'll be really happy and uh, which is not the case so uh, out of uh, five people uh, whomsoever i had discussed one or two people made money with ulip policies remaining people uh, the timeline and everything may not be suitable so they, they had lost money and they had either they had taken after fifth year or at the tenth year also the returns are very very less so that is the case which has been happening and uh, yesterday i was telling about tax saving um, uh, taxing fixed deposits along with this uh, ELSS is the best option tax saving deposits it doesn't do good so my order of preference will be first go for ELSS whatever the amount up to 1.5 lakhs go for ELSS and next choice will be uh, going for ULIP policies don't wait till fifth year pay till the premium term it may be 10 or 15 years and finally the last option should be the tax saving uh, fixed deposits this is how you should choose for uh, saving taxes in this financial year thank you so much for watching please share this video with your friends and also with uh, everyone so that they know how to take the uh, how to choose the investment product and make so much out of it uh, because the returns are much higher in elss mutual funds
compared to any other investment products go and check it out and uh, that may be rare cases it depends upon which kind of mutual funds which mutual fund you choose for tax sale thank you so much see you tomorrow in another video